Then in addition um, to all of this, uh, in modern civilizations, society and cultures, Satan and Satan's demons for this time have worked uh, drastically to put all of these distractions on world earth to completely distract you from even, you know, these different um, churches all the way to the left, way over here, in religion, okay? And um, those who put all kinds of evil and wicked and bad, those are promoting, you know, Satanism on, on prime time and television. Those are promoting the movies and television Satanism. Those are promoting the movies and television occult. Those are promoting in the movies and television um, all kinds of things to the left, like uh, Will and Grace, you know, this gay program teaching the gay lifestyle, and other programs subtly to blatantly teaching gay lifestyle. Um, those are promoting all kinds of bad and wicked and evil. Those are promoting um, American Idol, you know, like uh, let's make this person an idol, let's worship them like an idol, let's call it an idol. Those are promoting um, all kinds of things on television that are to the left. You know, is are what these churches are doing um, less of a sin than um, what is being done with television to movies and in, in songs and on radio? It's difficult to say, but I'm going to tell you this. Think about this very carefully. In the Garden of Eden, there was a preset or defined test that God and the host couldn't tell Adam and Eve about. And they told them simply, do not eat of this fruit. This is forbidden fruit. Do not eat of it. And when these eight of this, terrible things have happened to billions of people called mankind with a thousand year life expectancy, and now humans with a 70 year life expectancy, with breaking this or disobeying this one thing. Yet many of you are constantly disobeying the Ten Commandments with your Sunday keeping. Many of you are constantly breaking the Ten Commandments with worshiping other gods other than God of the Ten Commandments. Including worshiping a Godhead, a Triune God of Trinity. Including worshiping a Pope. Including worshiping anything else. You're also um, breaking other um, Ten Commandments. Ten Commandments, this is a landmark law that was carried into the New Testament, part of the New Covenant. Jesus uh, told us He did not abolish the law, the Ten Commandments. Therefore, the Ten Commandments is still in full, in, in full effect.